Hi, and welcome back to Wig Studio One. I'm Eileen, the Crazy Wig Lady, and today we're going to look at Tony Bratton Salon Select in Medium Blonde. Before we get started, I want to remind you, please don't forget to join us on our Facebook group, Wig Studio One Wig and Topper Support Group. It's a private Facebook group. We have wig sales on Sundays. We have live wig sales twice a month. So be sure to join us over there. It's a private Facebook group. Wig Studio One Wig and Topper Support Group. Also, don't forget to go to wigstudio1.com where you can see this cute cute summer style and all the other styles they have and there's discount information there everything over on wigstudio1.com okay let's get started tony bratton salon select All right, Salon Select by Tony Bratton. This is a nice summer style. I like a pixie. This is a perfect pixie. This has a little wave in it. As you can see, there's some curls in this wig. When I took it out of the box, I thought, wow, this is a wavy wig. It's really nice. I like her fibers. I think they're great. They're heat friendly. So you could add some more curl to this if you would like. You could straighten this more if you'd like. Let me show you the back. has a nice tight nape fits really really nice to the neck I like that on this wig that's important to me because anytime I look down and look up um, I don't want it to come off my neck and this does not like I said these are heat friendly fibers this also comes in a large cap size it's available in 11 shades as well okay the specs on this the front is four the crown is five the sides are about four the back is three and a half and it has that short 2.5 inch nape. So just a nice all over pixie. I put it behind my ears. You don't have to. You could wear it all forward. If you'll uh, wait to the end of this video, I'm going to insert some styling photos of different ways I styled it. Uh, like I said, see, it's just got some waves all through it. I would definitely we should spray this with some water if you want to really define those curls piece them out a little bit just put a little water in it that's the first thing I do almost every wig I take out of the box now this wig is a basic cap there are no bells and whistles here but that's okay you don't need a lace front you've got all of this fibers in the front the bangs that come just down like that I like these waves it gives it some personality I would want this to be really messy to me, the dead giveaway of a wig is one that's too fixed, so I like to just keep it messy, run my hands through it just like that. You could use some styling cream on this. They'd be really nice, too. I have some here. Just a little. It does not take much. You don't want to put too much because that will cause a buildup on your wigs. And then I just get my hands all the way down into the wig cap and pull away. And then you can just pull it however you would like. This fits me a little large. I have a 21 and a quarter inch head circumference. And I find this just a tad big. So I will pull it in using some adjusters. But just that little bit of styling cream. You can see you can create texture. You can really mess this up. You can wear it behind your ear. It has good coverage. There's my bio hair. It blends really well right with that rooting down into that. So, this is versatile. You could smooth it more if you like. Again, heat-friendly fibers, so keep your styling tools three, no, no higher than 350, usually around 325. But you could sleek this out more if you want to have more of a boy cut look. Or mess it up just by running your hands through it, and you can get those little waves back in it. Okay, let's go outside and have a look at this color, medium blonde.
Okay, let's look at this color indoors. It's a beautiful root. It is not overdone, the rooting at all on this wig. It is just what it says, a medium blonde. There are some light blonde running through it, as you can see, these highlights. So it's very dimensional. There's a lot of highlighting through here. There's gold in here. Really a light blonde highlight, but more golden, as you can tell. I like that she uses, she uses lots of different shades of blonde. And so to me, that does not make it flat in any way. So that let me uh, show you. I have, this is the light blonde. This is the medium blonde, and this is the light blonde in Tony Bratton. So you can see a little color comparison there of how they are like this much more ash and blonde, this much more gold. This is the light blonde. And then I have on the medium blonde. This has a lot more uh, platinum highlighting, where this is more blonde gold highlighting. Okay, let's look at the inside of the cap. Okay, the look at, a look at the inside of the cap of Salon Select. Basic cap construction, no lace front. Permatease, yes, all through here. Open wefted, open ear tabs with stays. Open extended nape with Velcro adjusters. And there is stretch in this wig. And like I said, this is available in a large cap as well. And here's another look at medium blonde. Okay, that is a look at Tony Bratton Salon Select in the color medium blonde. I hope you enjoyed this. Again, please don't forget to go to wigstudio1.com and uh, see all the styles there and get information on discounting. Everything is available on the website. And don't forget to join us on Facebook, Wig Studio One, Wig and Topper Support Group. Also, Instagram. We post twice a day on Instagram. So join us on all those social media platforms. Thanks again so much. Have a great day, and I'll see you next time.